Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Screamin' Sicilian Pizza Company. This is the Cinnamon Apple Loaded Breadsticks. They were $6.99 at Meijer. I'm going to go ahead and take it out of the package. It comes in a pan like this. Ooh, and you get some sauce. So the directions for this will be a little bit different. Hold on. Let me find it. Okay, it says preheat oven to 425. Remove plastic wrap and place pan in oven. Place caramel packet in a bowl of warm water. So I will do that. I'll get a bowl of warm water. So that's a caramel packet. And then we're going to bake it for 25 to 27 minutes. Then we remove the breadsticks from um, pan from oven and drizzle the caramel over the breadsticks. Okay. Sounds like a plan. So I'll show you how it looks. This is the first one that hasn't fully filled the pan. Of course, you know what? They've always been cheese, haven't they? They've been cheese, yeah. yeah. So the cheese, but that is some kind of white sauce. Like Look frosting. at that. Yeah, that looks that looks really, really good. So I'm going to get this in a bowl of warm water. I'm going to get that in the oven, and we'll be back. Okay, so these were in the full time, and uh, this one, you can really see the definition of where they uh, want you to cut the breadsticks. This has been in water and um, so I'm gonna squeeze it out over the whole top. What do you think? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, I didn't know if you thought I should put it on the plate. No, I would just drizzle it over the whole thing. I'll go back, because I know that first one did not get much. I have to say, it's a, it's a thin caramel, but that's good because it's easy to uh, uh, slide out of this bag. So I like that. Okay. And a funny fact is on all these videos where we've, hopefully you've seen them before, I have not used a pizza cutter. <laughs> On any of them and tonight I'm like why in the world haven't I been using a pizza cutter to cut these I do not know why well you really didn't know where they were anyway so. no it's hard to tell it was hard to tell on the other ones where the lines were some you just kind of had to guess but now I mean it should fresh. it should be easier to cut <laughs> it yeah look that was so much easier with a pizza cutter so, that's what I recommend you do, is use a pizza cutter. So this box, um, all the other, the loaded breadsticks that we've reviewed before, there's been three, um, so hopefully you watch those. Um, none of those, well, yes One they did. did. The nacho had a description, but the, reg the regular like garlic cheese, I don't mm. remember that one having a description. The pepperoni didn't have a description. If it did, just we pepperoni. missed it. Yeah, I, I could have missed it. Uh, but this set does say caramel sauce packet included. There's a picture of that. And this one says it is Fuji apples, oatmeal, cinnamon, cookie, crumble, and cream cheese sauce. So that's what that white sauce the is. White sauce it's is. cream cheese sauce. Okay. It so, smells really good. Like a lot of brown sugar going on. It does smell really good. One breadstick is 130 calories, and there are nine servings in the box. So mm, I like a little oatmeal crumble. It's okay. good. Let's see. I, I gave us forks, but you know, let me just just bite it. I like the apples by themselves. I'm gonna get it. I my like apple the oatmeal fell. by itself. My apple fell off. Huh? I don't know if I like the cream cheese part. That's what I'm gonna get more of. Like the apple's really, really good. I'm gonna get it all together. It's very hot to eat it like this, by the way. It's either the cream cheese or the crust. I think it's the cream cheese. I I like it. It's fine. Um, there's nothing wrong with it. I think it's good. I think you'll be pleased with it. 
um, where where I don't like as, it as much is the cream cheese bar because I would, I'll tell you what I was hoping it would be before I read on there that it was cream cheese. I was hoping it would be like when you buy a box of toaster strudels and you get that white. Just the frosting. Just that frosting, that, mm -hmm. that really sweet. Yeah, I think um, that would have been better. It would have been better. Yes, it would have been better if it wasn't cream cheese because you really taste that. It's not sour, but it's, it's heading that way. It is, um, it's not just sweet. And I think um, if they had had just a, a sugar, a sweet sugar glaze like you get in toaster strudels, that would have been perfect with the apple. Because I do like the apple. I do like the crumble. The apple and the crumble is the best part. Yes, it is. I don't know if I like the crust either. Because when I'm taking a bite of it, it almost smells like pizza. Mm -hmm. So it's like, it just throws me off. It's just, I don't know. Um, let me see if I can get a bite without the... Um... I know, it's kind of hard to do. Um, it's good. I like it, but I don't know that I would necessarily buy it again. <laughs> mm -hmm. Did you get just the crust? Mm -hmm. Well, the sauce, you have to get out. I got it without the cream cheese. Yeah. That crust does have a flavor. Yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. And I think that's what stole me off is that crust having a flavor. Yeah. yeah. It's good. Like I said, I don't know if I would necessarily it's, buy it again. It's but... sticky. Yeah, get ready to, to get a little bit messy. I yeah. don't mind that though. Um, it's okay. And you know, I think it's awesome that they're trying to branch out and do different mm -hmm. things. Yeah. I think it's awesome. Um, honestly though, when I want a pizza, I'm going to go for just a, a regular pizza. Yeah. I'm not going to buy a dessert pizza. No, if I, if I want, yeah, exactly. If I want something sweet, I'll, I'll get brownies or ice cream or yeah. something like cinnamon that. Cinnamon rolls even, you know. Cinnamon <laughs> rolls, yeah. If I'm wanting cinnamon, I'll get yeah. cinnamon rolls. But if I want a pizza, I want the, the, uh, the that Bessie's Revenge. The Bessie's Revenge is still our favorite Scrimmage Sicilian pizza. That's our favorite one. Um, but they have great pepperoni pizzas and they have uh, the meats and all that. Mm -hmm. So I would rather have that for a pizza than a sweet pizza. But I think if you get this, I, I don't think you'll be disappointed in it. Yeah, I think you'll it's, like them. Yeah, because the apple's good, the cinnamon's good. Mm -hmm. It's not too much cinnamon, no, it's not overpowering. No, it's, nice. it's not just a, like a powdered raw cinnamon, it's nice and sweet. Yes. Oh. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.